This is Elaine in Blender. And this is Elaine using the provided female IK rig in Unreal Engine 5. That's right, all I had to do was import the mesh, set up the IK rig, and with the help of a single node, the entire default NMBP was mine. All mine! <laughs> uh, so, yeah, here's how you do it. If you take a quick peek inside the IK rig provided by Epic, you'll see something like this. Over here, we've got all these rig elements with these fancy stick men looking at. And down here, we got all these chains with names and bones and goals and dreams. Wait, where's that cursor going? Families. No, don't do it. No. This here is the IK rig that I made. If I put them side by side and do a wee bit of editing magic, kind of like this, I bet you can see where I'm going. But in case you can't, let's just redo the left arm together. So I'm just gonna go no, over here please, and no. this. Okay, and now we can toss that bad boy back in by going over here, selecting all of the arm elements, right clicking and selecting new retarget chain. So as you can see, setting it's, up an IK but how? Oh my God, you won't believe what I saw. There's- He's a witch, let's get him. Whoa, uh, yeah, just don't forget to reset your retarget root node and you'll be okay. They're just gonna keep on, uh, hmm. So now we've got a rig. What do we even do with this thing? Looking at this menu over here, you can see that the animation retargeting actually only has two assets associated with it. The thing that we just did, and the thing that we're gonna do now. Or, well, the thing that you're gonna do now. Here's the one that I made. You put the rig belonging to the character associated with the anim BP you want to use in the target slot right there, and the IK rig belonging to your character in the target slot. Then, down here, we have the chain mapping area. You can either set these manually, blah blah yada, yada, yada. blah, or you can just click this button, select map all fuzzy, and wha-bam! There's actually still a little bit more work to do, I don't know why I just did that. You see the target mesh scale over here? You can use this if the scale of your characters are off. And up here, make sure to select the source, and then you can create a new pose so that your character's poses match as well. You can also do this with the target, but I find the best results when you only edit this source in this case. See this? This character right here? That looks pretty lifeless, doesn't it? Well, that's why we have these things! Now just look at how impressive that is. No, wait. Here we go. Just make an anim BP for the skeleton that you made your IK rig for, drop in this node, and congratulations! You've done it. Now go, go on, go, go make something. Get out of here. <laughs> 